Guitar FDT. FDT stands for Fretboard Domination Trainer. Purely and simply, this is all it is. Um, and there's also a, a bass, five string bass FDT as well, and others coming out. This is a demonstration on how to use it, how I've designed it to be used. Okay, let's turn it on. Okay, so what we have is just a list of the scales. So you've got your five minor pentatonic patterns. Um, and you've got your major scale patterns, five as well, five for all these. Your blues, we'll just pass the blues. Um, and harmonic minor scale, five patterns, and the melodic minor, five patterns, five, okay. So what we'll do is we'll just, so you've got your patterns, five patterns for each scale um, and around. So there's your blue scale pattern there. Okay, so we'll leave it on the major scale pattern, which is what I'll just demonstrate it on. Patterns, so around that you've just got your metronome on the outside, going from 80 to 150, no particular reason only, that's all I could space it in for. But I find 80 is probably low enough to start anything on. Once you get to 150, for example, if you're at 1s on 150, if you go into 2s on 80, then that's basically mm -hmm. the next step up. So no, so what, what the idea of it is, you learn your five patterns in a scale. So here we've got the major scale. So pattern number one, G rather, so pattern number one. Okay, so you learn that, um, start it on 80, just do ones and play it on that. Okay, so then you learn your next pattern. Leave the mention name on. Next pattern. Okay, so, so on, so you learn your five patterns. Pattern three, pattern four, pattern five, that gives you the whole fretboard in a particular key for the major scale. All right, so then what you do, go back to pattern one. All right, okay. So ones, so then what, what you do is you learn each pattern, play them at ones, pretty easy. So ones just means one, one note per beat. Um, of the metronome. Work your way all around nice and slow. Don't move on until you've got it sort of nice and smooth and strong. Get to 150. So just drag and drop. There we are. Drag and drop. Tap and slide. Spend too much time on the computer. Okay, so there's 150. So. So you just practice doing that. Do it with each pattern. And so on, okay. There we go, tap and slide your finger. Um, and then, once you've done that, then you go around to 80 again. Instead of doing ones, you do twos. Okay, one and two and... Okay, so you go all the way around again. Let's stop that. Tap and slide, and then so let's say around 150 again on twos. There we go. Okay. So that'll be. Da, 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 da. So forth, okay. Twos, comfortable with twos. Then we go around to 80 again and we do threes, which is triplets, or three beats, three counts per beat. So it's da 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 da
so on. Okay. So you're all the way around again. Don't move on till you've got each sort of, it only goes up in fives. So five is, is enough, but not too far each time. 150 at triplets, once you're comfortable with those. That's da 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 So once you're comfortable with that, then of course after threes is fours. So then you go around to fours, so you start at 80 again. So that will be da 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 Once you get around to 150, he's fours at 150. I'm not warmed up, so that would be. So on, okay. So that's the idea of it. So you've got um, what you what you do is then. Once you've got your patterns, once, once you can work your individual patterns at a certain speed, join them all together. So maybe go up one. Yeah, next one. That, that's the idea of the, um, the fretboard domination train. Very simple, not complex at all. It's not designed to do 100 things, just one thing in particular, but it will give you the patterns for the five main scales that basically will cover any style of music. And of course, you can le also learn them on acoustic as well as electric. Good luck. <laughs>